The fight to reopen a Providence public pool has taken an ugly turn. It's a story we've been tracking for months. Mayor Angel Tavares decided to permanently close the Davy Lopes pool earlier this year because of the high cost of maintenance coupled with dwindling usage. But one city councilor who's pushing for the pool to reopen is now accusing the mayor of political blackmail. Iowa just News reporter Mark Kennedy joins us now from Providence with the latest developments. While the Providence mayor says it would be cheaper to open water spray parks, local contractors are now offering their services for free to keep the pool open. Months after the Davy Lopes pool closes in Southside Providence, community members tell Eyewitness News they're still feeling its effects. We'll stand by our kids as long as I'm here. Anybody else who represents this neighborhood will always be here for our kids. Councilman David Sanchez called a meeting on Monday with community members. The offer was vote in favor of the budget and we'll keep your pool open and anything you need will go in nicely. And this is all because I voted against the budget. Are you saying this is political blackmail? Yeah, it is political blackmail. We reached out to the mayor's office. They tell us in response to the accusation, quote, this is a baseless charge and it is insulting. The administration's FY14 budget never contained funding to operate the pool this year. Councilman Sanchez was present at this meeting. Monday, Mayor Tavares tells Eyewitness News, despite the complaints, he's still continuing the process of shutting down the pool. What I did was invest the money into a summer camp that fed the kids breakfast, fed the kids lunch, made sure that they were involved from the beginning of the day to the end of the day versus having a pool that was being very lightly used in the afternoon from 1 to 5 o'clock perhaps. So what I did was invest so that we could serve more children, more children. That's what I did. And I believe that we made the right decision. I hear that some people don't agree. Guess what? I'm the mayor of the city of Providence. My responsibility is to the full city to doing what I believe is best for everyone in the city. Reporting with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Mark Kennedy, Eyewitness News.